Monday morning, and look at this. Already had it. Can't wait to share with you what I'm doing today. You know something? Never, ever, 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 even with my best mate Trevor, be too busy to do an act of kindness. No matter what. So I, I'm flat out this week. I'm speaking in Wales, Blackpool, Blackburn, Darwin, and I've still made the time for my friend Danny in Australia for Be Kind of Day on the 22nd of June. Look at all this gubbins here. All the gear. No idea I'm charging the gimbal up. I've got my little microphones charging up. Oh. So check this out, kindness crew. I've just landed here at this place. I don't know if you can see it. Let's go up here. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's all over the show. I've just landed there at uh, T Print and I'm meeting the managing director, Paul Bainbridge. B -b 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 Bainbridge. Why am I telling you that? Because I've got this idea um, with my uh, Kindness Matters clothing range. They did some clothes for me during the lockdown and I've come up with an idea. Uh, I don't want the money. I want to donate it to a charity. So I've been trying to think of a charity of my choice. So check this out. I'm just at. Uh, um... I'm just at tea print and wait till you see, I can't wait to, to show you this. Let me know in the comments section who could we give all of that money to so that when I go on my UK tour and any schools or any children or families buy clothing range, Kindness Matters Clothing. It has a very powerful message behind it, but all the money goes to the charity that me and the Kindness crew choose. Let me know in the comments section below what you think we should give that money to. everybody i've just landed here at anchor's home primary school to meet um, head teacher mr dow so all of the pupils at this school um, did the kindness matters 30 day challenge and i can imagine when the kindness coach visits their school it's fair to say they're going to be a little bit excited <laughs> Thornton Cleveley's at Bispen Primary School and we're gonna we're gonna talk to some of these what year are we? Six. Year six and we're gonna speak to the year six and they're gonna share with the kindness coach what acts of kindness they remembered from the kindness matters 30, 30 day challenge and more importantly how did they apply what they learned? Uh, my name is Jonah and the tip that I remember was saying thank you to the teacher and after I heard it I said thank you to, to my teacher every day. Fantastic. How do you think that might have made the teacher feel? It might have made her feel happy. So who have we got here? What's your name, please? Isabella. And the kindest tip I remember is complimenting someone. And after I heard that, every day that I thought someone looked a bit sad, um, I gave them a compliment and I think it cheered them up a bit. Thank you for your kindness. And then who have we got here? Um, I'm Lucy. And the kindest tip I remember is holding a door open for somebody. And the way I applied that is I saw someone with like loads of stuff in their hands and I opened the door and yeah. Fantastic. And then we've got, let's have a look here. What's your name please? Hi, I'm Lucy and the kindest tip I remember is picking up uh, rubbish on the floor. And how I applied this is at the park, when I saw rubbish on the floor I put it in the bin straight away. Brilliant. Now we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to talk about what acts of kindness we could do. So what acts of kindness could we do? Um, my name is Lauren and an act of kindness we could do is helping each other with like work or with lessons. That's a really good kindness. Thanks for sharing that. And who have we got here please? Hi, I'm Jake and a kindness thing that you could do is go to someone that you might see in the playground, sat on a bench, look inside and go over and ask them if they're all right and possibly play with them. <laughs> So Miss, uh, what's your name please? Uh, Miss Allardyce. And what year do you teach? I teach year six. 
and would you share with me and all the kindness crew what impacts um, the Kindness Matters 30 Day Challenge had on the children? Uh, the impact was that the children were obviously thinking about kindness much more all the time. They were thinking about how they could help each other and they just developed um, a lot of empathy as well. They put themselves in each other's shoes um, and they just they got along much, much better to be honest. Um, they were just using kindness all of the time. So yeah, it's brilliant. If there's any other schools, any other Year 6 teachers watching this, um, what would you say to them about um, taking the Kindness Matters 30 Day Challenge? I think it's definitely worth it just to see the children getting along with each other and I think we take for granted that children know just what kindness is but actually sometimes they need to be taught and actually need to see it in action um, and just doing it day to day, so yeah. Your kindness tip that you remember? Um, my kindness tip was to um, ask people how their day has been and how I applied that was when I went home I asked my entire family how their day was and if it would, they had a bad day I would just make them feel better about it. Kindness Matters 30 day program to any primary school. It's amazing. Mr. Bond, <laughs> I, we expect you to die. <laughs> Just getting ready, this is the head teacher and all the staff just waiting for the press to come. And I'm um, really excited to speak with all the pupils as we all get ready for Be Kind Today to talk about why kindness matters and celebrate it in, in memory of Billy Kinder. Some of us have very different types of families, don't we? Everyone's family is slightly different. Every time when we talk on the phone, your voices make me feel so alone. But don't feel bad because I shouldn't be sad. The best part about it is when I see you again. So, what was that specifically about family? I was picturing one of my family situations. Hi everybody, just want to say a massive thank you for everybody on Be Kind of Day today. It was absolutely incredible at Westminster Primary Academy in Blackpool. Massive shout out to Bramley Sunnyside in Rotherham. And is it Oindell Anglican School in Sydney, Australia, mate? So I hope you took something positive from today. Please be kind, like, comment and subscribe. So let me know in the comment section below what you enjoyed about what you've watched in this week's blog.